The U.S. State Department approved a potential foreign military sale, FMS, to the government of Croatia, involving the acquisition of eight UH-60M Black Hawk helicopters, along with various related equipment and services, with an estimated cost of $500 million. Croatia presently operates four UH-60 helicopters, with the initial two procured from the United States in 2018, and an additional two acquired without cost. The delivery of the initial pair of Black Hawk helicopters occurred in February 2022. In addition to the helicopters themselves, the foreign military sale, FMS, encompasses 19 T-700 GE-701D engines, with 16 to be installed in the helicopters and 3 held as spares. Furthermore, the proposed deal includes a substantial amount of communication and safety equipment. Croatia is set to receive 20 and slash ARC 231 ART 1987 Very High Frequency VHF slash Ultra High Frequency UHF slash Line of Sight LOS Satellite Communications SATCOM radios, along with 10 and slash AR 57 Counter Missile Warning Systems CMWS to enhance threat detection capabilities. To aid navigation and situational awareness, 20H-764U Embedded Global Position Systems with Inertial Navigation EGI, are part of the package, equipped with Selective Availability Anti-Spoofing Module SOSM, or a future replacement. The proposed sale also includes 18 M240H machine guns, along with a comprehensive range of equipment, from radar warning receivers and laser detecting sets to cryptographic systems and rescue hoist equipment. In terms of communication and safety, the proposed deal includes an slash ARC 231RT 1808A, or future replacement, VHF slash UHF slash low SATCOM radios, APR 39C, V, 1 quarter radar warning receivers, AVR 2B laser detecting sets, and APX 123A identification friend or foe, IFF, transponders, or future replacement. Additionally, the government of Croatia will acquire military communication equipment such as the ARC-220 high-frequency HF radio with KY-100M VRC-100 ground stations and slash PYQ-10 simple key loader SKL and KIV-77 common identification friend or foe IFF crypto applique computers, contributing to enhanced interoperability and security in communication. The proposed sale includes various aviation systems as well, such as the N slash ARN 147V VHF Omnidirectional Range, the slash Instrument Landing System ILS Receiver Radio, and slash ARN 149V Low Frequency LF slash Automatic Direction Finder ADF Radio Receiver, and slash ARN 153 Tactical Air Navigation System TACAN Receiver Transmitter and slash APN 209 radar altimeter, and then slash ARC 210 radios. To address safety concerns, the package also offers EBC 406 HM emergency locator transmitter ELT systems, encrypted aircraft wireless intercommunication systems EWIS, improved heads-up display IHUD technology with corresponding signal data converters, and forward-looking infrared FLIR capabilities with electro-optical and infrared EO-IR features. Moreover, the proposed deal includes enhanced ballistic armor protection systems EBAPS, to ensure the safety of aircrew members, as well as internal auxiliary fuel tank systems IAFTS, to extend the helicopter's range and endurance. Additionally, the package encompasses fast rope insertion and extraction system FRIES, external rescue hoist, RH, rescue hoist equipment sets, and dual patient litter system, DPLS, sets, enhancing the helicopter's versatility in search and rescue capabilities. The UH-60M Black Hawk is a versatile medium-lift utility helicopter developed by the American company Sikorsky Aircraft. It is part of the larger UH-60 Black Hawk family, which has been in service with the U.S. Army since 1978. The UH-60M is the latest variant, introduced to extend the helicopter's service life into the 2020s. With over 5,000 units produced, 
it serves various international customers as well. Designed for versatility, the UH-60M can serve various roles such as troop transport, medical evacuation, command and control, search and rescue, and armed escort. It offers low detectability and excellent map of the Earth flight capabilities. The helicopter is also designed to withstand small arms fire and most high explosive projectiles, providing protection for its occupants. The UH-60M Black Hawk's avionics suite includes a digitized cockpit, autopilot, navigation system, and vehicle health management system, enhancing its overall capabilities. This helicopter can carry a crew of two pilots and two crew chiefs slash gunners and has a maximum takeoff weight of 9,979 kilograms. It can transport up to 11 seated troops, six stretchers, or 9,000 pounds of cargo externally. It has a maximum speed of 183 miles per hour and a combat range of 370 miles. Powered by two General Electric T700 GE 701C D turboshaft engines, each producing 1,994 horsepower, the UH 60M Black Hawk can attain a maximum speed of 294 km per hour while its cruise speed is 282 km per hour at maximum range. The helicopter has a combat range of 590 kilometers, 370 miles or 320 nautical miles, and a ferry range of 2,221 kilometers, 1,380 miles or 1,199 nautical miles, when equipped with ESSS stub wings and external tanks. It has a service ceiling of 5,800 meters and a rate of climb of 8.36 meters per second. The UH-60M Black Hawk has a length of 19.76 meters, a width of 2.36 meters, and stands 5.13 meters tall. The helicopter's weight specifications comprise an empty weight of 5,675 kilograms and a maximum takeoff weight of 9,979 kilograms. It is powered by two General Electric T700 GE 701C D turboshaft engines, each generating 1,994 horsepower. The main rotor spans a diameter of 16.36 m, covering an area of 210 square meters. Armed variants of the UH 60M can carry various weaponry, including options such as 2x7.62mm M240 machine guns, 2x7.62mm M134 miniguns, or 2x12.7mm GAU-19 Gatling guns. The helicopter has four hardpoints, with two on each ESSS stub wing, enabling the attachment of different weapon combinations. It can carry 70mm Hydra 70 unguided rockets in either a 7-tube, M260, or 19-tube, M261, pod. Additionally, it can mount up to four AGM-114 Hellfire laser-guided air-to-ground missiles or two AIM-92 Stinger heat-seeking air-to-air missiles on each hardpoint. The Hellfire launcher rails can also accommodate M260, 7-tube, hydropods. Other armament options include gun pods in various calibers, such as 7.62 mm, 12.7 mm, 20 mm, or 30 mm. Furthermore, it can be fitted with a volcano minefield dispersal system to meet specific mission requirements. 